Hey guys, on today's tutorial, I'm going to teach you how to get Canon Utility working on the new OS X from Mac. Okay, so I'm this right near here right now. And as you can see, my utility is open and ready to be used. Okay, so in order to get it working again, um, we're going to quit that. Now, you might think that Canon will be up to date, but no. They do have it under their website, at least they have the name of the OS X, but they haven't updated their software, so it works. So, what we need to do is to get around that problem. Um, so we're gonna get right into it. First of all, go into your applications, okay? So just open up that folder. So if you can't find applications like that, just type in applications here, and you will be able to find them okay um, next we're gonna scroll down till we see your Canon utility so that's right here we're just gonna open it up now under that we're just gonna look for this now we're just gonna open that up now you need to right click on this so you can either right click to tap if you have um, double tap I mean um, with two fingers just tap on your pad if you have a MacBook Pro or just press control and then left click on it so and then you'll get this um, once you have that just uh, show package contents okay go into contents now we're gonna go right to the end where it says supported apps and see this right here if you open this up right now you will see this so it works right so all you have to do is drag this down here make a shortcut for it just leave it there so I already did that so I have it right here so I left it right there so anytime I tap on it it will work okay so this is the way to get right around it it's not a hundred percent the proper way let's say since Canon once again hasn't updated just yet but this is the way to get around it so we don't have to use iPhoto to download our raw pictures and um, that way we can still use the Canon utility to download our pictures to our computers okay so this works with any camera that you have uh, basically that's Canon and that's the way to get around it anyways if you guys have still problems with it or have any questions you can write them here below on the comments area and don't forget to subscribe and rate thank you